girls welcome back to my channel it's me kizzy so we're about to go on a little walk or i don't know a drive i don't know carlo ran to the store so i know for sure we got to pick up um a couple household things a couple things for the closet that he built me so that's what we're gonna do and i may record a little bit and i may not but we'll see so guys we're going on our nice little walk but we had to head back home to uh give something to paul you know he a little baby oh, we're gonna go home then go ahead to breakfast <laughs> the kids go everywhere with us right babe yeah Every everywhere they supposed to they go everywhere so i mean this is nice me and carlo have this nice walk and me and him go to breakfast so I can get to know him a little bit better. Ding, ding, ding. So we're just walking. It's kind of, like I told you guys earlier, it's kind of cool. I think I, I wish I had some gloves on. I get cold really fast, seriously. And plus I have like issues with my thumb. I have a, um, oh, I have a glomus tumor in my thumb and it hurts. It hurts uh, with cold. It hurts if I accidentally bump it. It literally just hurts. I've been uh, procrastinating with the surgery because I have to get insurance. The surgery is $10,000. I know I have to take care of myself because actually it went to my index finger. I had surgery on my thumb about 10 years ago and the pain came back about five years ago. And I think, I don't know if it's because I'm older, it's almost at the point where it's unbearable. Sometimes I have to sleep with my thumb under Carlo pillow or I have to like wrap it up. Like last night, I literally wrapped my thumb in a uh, in a towel because it was hurting so bad. So I just decided I'm gonna put me first and I'm gonna go ahead and, you know, see about my thumb because it's crazy because it went onto the other finger or whatever. So we're back home. So gotta get Paul. He's probably mad because uh. I don't want to walk. We just did that walk. We just walked two blocks and then Paul called to tell us he wanted something. So that's what we have to go do. It looks like the uh, forest over here. I don't know if you guys can see it, but yeah. Whole bunch of trees. That's what's happening. Oh, okay. So I know you guys is waiting to see my tree again. I don't mind. <laughs> I'll show it. It's nice. Isn't that nice? Super cute. I'm gonna go check on Mary. She had like a little stomach ache. Oh, it's my other tree. Don't talk about it. <laughs> it looks crazy. Spotless, yes. Hey baby, you okay? So I'm sitting down, thank God. I'm tired. He always want to walk like every Sunday. I mean, it's nice to go on walks. Um, me and the kids and Carlos. What? Did you recognize him? Just seen him oh, yeah. That's crazy. So we gotta go and find somewhere to eat. I think I get turned off real fast when it comes to uh, going to breakfast places. Um, Carlo too, because we've been to a few places because he always says me never wanting to wait. You know, we went to one place when they were saying, I think it was Denny's, they were telling everybody to have on a mask, but the cooks wasn't wearing one, right, babe? Yes, right. Yeah. They were making food and you guys are telling us to wear masks, but they don't have on one. So we left, but today my stomach is growling, so I just hope it's not really a long wait. I just want the basics. Just I mean, the only place we really eat at, is that my stomach on camera? The only place we really eat at is IHOP. With no problem, the one in Merrill's Park. Um, I think I felt like they food tastes like syrup or something. I hate pancakes, I hate syrup, I hate the whole thought of it. It's, 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 uh, it's really nasty to me. I don't like the, the, the scent of syrup. It's the same way I feel about watermelon. Like everybody in my house loves watermelon. Everybody in my house loves pancakes and syrup. Even as a kid, my mom said I'm just like my dad because my dad uh, don't like uh, watermelon. I can't stand it, but I'll eat the candy. I just don't like the fruit. Um, so we're headed to the place now. I don't know where 
favorite one, but um, I was just actually thinking if we could do like a um, like a mom and pops. Did you, did you like courageous victory, or you'll never go back there again? Well, they were racist. Yeah, we went to Courageous Bakery when it first opened, and yeah, they would never get our money ever. Never. I don't care if it was just like the last place to eat at. So yeah, they was just. I didn't like it. It's, it's it's really doesn't sit well with me when I come across a person that's racist. So I mean, it doesn't matter if even if you're a black person, you racist. So I I just don't like it. Guys, this man was just dancing. Best I, I can't even. He was doing all type of moves like Michael Jackson. Okay. Delilah's Kitchen. Wanna try that out? Sure. about putting Tabasco sauce on my egg. Look at this mirror. I got a face cover. Look at this mirror. Yay. I know these folks like, lady, move. So this is what we looking at. Food. I forgot today was Halloween. I was trying to figure out why this lady came to the table looking like a pirate. My kids, we don't celebrate Halloween. My oldest is 20. Didi 21? My oldest is 21. Next, I got my son. He's 18. I mean, they. I don't know what they really do now. You know, they older, but we've never celebrated Halloween ever. Um, yeah, my kids don't feel like they missing out. And you know, I usually always try to put my tree up on the 31st. This is their food, that's Carlos' food. Mm. 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 This is my food. Yummy. Mm. 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 Got my Tabasco sauce. Mm. Hey guys, so we're back from the store and my package came. I feel so tired. My thumb is hurting so bad. Really bad. It's like, I feel like it's literally on fire right now. But, um, here's my best friend. <laughs> so, I'm just going to show you guys how it look. And I can look link in the description um, where I got it. Of course, it's Amazon or whatever. It gives you like a little cap or whatever. And I'm not going to do my hair on film. I'll just probably come back to show my hair after. It's pretty pretty long. I don't I don't like it. I'm cut it, cut it, cut it. So It's pretty, babe. What you think? He want me to put it on right now. Oh. This wig is a lace from Oh, okay, so it's just half, just a piece, like a four by four. So I usually do a part on the side. I don't know, I don't really, I like the middle part, but I think it's just, I don't know if it's overrated, but I don't know. I'm gonna try to see how that looks on me because I usually um, leave out my own like hair in the front. Uh, yeah, but I guess with some of the wigs, like this one in particular, it comes with um, baby hair, but I don't never care about that. Hey guys, welcome back. So I'm done. Okay, so this is it. It's kind of cute. I think I like it. I kind of 
got the part not in the middle but slightly on the side so i'm usually like putting like a gel in my hair i didn't really do it this time i just used um like a setting lotion and water i think i want to go for more like a um a dry curl look but overall i like it and i did have lace in back of the wig so i just had to cut that off just like at the nape of my neck so i think this wig was um 144. i don't want to really zoom in because i'm not a pro this is just what it is but i'll do it it looks a little bit crooked but whatever see i told you i like to leave uh some of my own hair out now i just gotta get my eyebrows arched by carlo but other than that i like it i think i took about four inches off it's still rather long but but um yeah so i like it just let me know what you guys think it's really pretty from a distance it's really cute um i mean it's cute too up close so this is it's not really a new look for me but i'm just gonna hold off with all like the gel material but overall i think i like it i think it'll be really popping once my eyebrows is arch now i think i want to go on a dinner date <laughs> so yeah i gotta go and uh see what carlo thinks about it this is my man playing basketball in the hole <laughs> Nothing. Nothing. Come here.